Let's see. Oh, I hear that music. Oh my god. Yo. <laughs> Hopefully this this damage thing is gonna work. Let's find out. Oh my god, look at that. This is what I'm talking about. It's actually working. The dummy just died. <laughs> All right, guys. So JJS just released an update almost the same time as the Realm Rampage. And I made a video of Realm Rampage already. Feel free to check this video if you want to see what the update was about. But like I said, JJS just released an update too. It's a small update, but it's a high quality update, guys. So this is more of a build mode. So I think that's the main thing about this update. So let me show you real quick what what this build mode like a feature they've added in the game as you guys can see inputs outputs logic so i'm gonna show you my understanding of how this thing works but let's showcase mahito first because like mahito also got a revamp move so that's actually the head splitter so goodbye to head splitter right now because tze change it to i forgot a name so it's actually called drill splitter so that's the replacement of the head splitter i honestly don't know what is this uh let's okay all right, man, I don't know if this is better than head splitter. I mean, head splitter is like fun and looks goofy that perfectly matches to like the concept of the game. But I'm not saying this one is bad, but this is like more brutal move compared to the head splitter. I guess the safest way to use it is like when you're here and bam. All right, I mean, that's cool to be honest with you. But if you ask me, like that head splitter thing, that was like one of the funniest, goofiest move TZE added in the game. I hope he's gonna add it at least, like, you know, a variant or a special move or something like that. But this one looks dope as well. But like I said, it's like more brutal. And also, Z added this new organized game mode system. And this is a very self explanatory rank. When you click the rank, so that teleports you to like the lobby. And the public server is the actual battleground game that you guys normally play when you join the server. And then the custom server allows you to create your custom server. So let's say, for example, I'll create mine. That's it. Very straight straightforward so like server title so nicolaps just an example create so now that will teleport me to like the server that i created you can also join other people's server as well so if you like click on this thing it will like load up different servers that people created so i'm not gonna join this server for now but instead we'll talk about this new build mode thing which is really interesting guys so besides adding more blocks and materials from this update z also added this input and output thing which you know i, I tested this earlier but i'm gonna show you what i understand about this i mean it's it's so confusing i might be wrong but like feel free to let me know in the comment section for what i understand you need to have this touch block which is in other words a trigger you know it's kind of like just your trigger let's call it trigger so like you guys have an understanding you know at least more comprehensible and not sound confusing you know fyi like let's say if i disable this um free build right so it disappears so it's kind of hard to see that so i recommend you guys add at least like a block so just like an indication all right so the moment i step on this area right here that means something's gonna happen to the next material that i'm gonna put beside right now let's add an output so sound light and damage block so damage block i honestly don't know this one yet but let's just add this one right here all right let's put three because we're going to add three different outputs so now we're going to add a light block in here and then lastly the sound block there should be something playing in here once we hit this trigger right here but there is a configuration so you have to like stay with me because i'll show you how to to configure to like to make this thing work so like i got light sound and the death so i i think i have to spawn like a dummy in here i hope this is gonna work if i step in here 
nothing's gonna happen because i need to configure this first right so if you click on each of this you guys will see like input sound input and for the light input and output first i have to configure the output id of this thing i you, you can put whatever you want just make sure that you remember it just for now i'm just gonna put one hit enter so i got like one as a trigger so i have to sync this into these guys over here right now i have to put sound input one so that like whenever i hit this one this area where the trigger is it should start playing the music put the sound input id and then the sound id i mean the same as like the kill sound you guys can grab that in any roblox thing so you know this one as an example right so i'm gonna copy this code right here you can also like use your customized sound so i'm gonna put the sound id and then i can set it to loop or not loop and then hit enter now let's do the light as well so now this is different because it has input id and output id so obviously output one should technically connect whenever i hit this trigger and then i should put one here as well i may be wrong like i said but feel free to correct me in the comment section so input id one just to be safe so i got all these three sync together right so let's see yeah nothing happened right now like i don't know let's oh there you go it's because of this thing so i should have moved it at least it's not gonna cover the one in the middle right let's see oh i hear that music oh my god yo <laughs> and now let's check this damage thing all right so damage um let's set it i don't know like the default was one but let's let's do it five and then input is one so these three are now finally connected to each other so like hopefully this this damage thing is gonna work let's find out oh my god look at that this is what i'm talking about it's actually working so now let's set this to loop and we'll see what you say the dummy just died oh <laughs> yeah i'm not gonna die obviously because nobody's stepping on the trigger there is also a logic which i still don't understand until now but let's just play around with this real quick so this one is so i don't know what that's supposed to mean but let's configure that and then another logic is the not gate but this is more of really about like how you configure the inputs and the outputs so let's say one so see that output whoa okay there you go so something's happening so i put a trigger in this gate that triggers that light in the sound thing right which what i don't want but see that i mean it's so hard to explain but like if you guys are the one that's actually playing this you can analyze it really quickly so i'm not gonna put anything in there for now now let's do the timer block so this timer block thing is supposed to be a timer so you can configure the input and output as well and then the delay time so let's say i put three which i suppose this is three seconds right and then one and then one so let's see what happens what you say? What you say? so I, i'm out of this trigger but they are still playing i'm not sure if this is because of this timer thing yep it is actually because of that timer okay that makes sense because when i step in here and then i get out of this box see it turns the light off and the music as well so now i think i have a pretty good understanding of like these three the trigger or the touch block and the outputs however these logics i mean it's 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 still confusing for me right now but you guys know that it worked when i put the timer in this one as well so just feel free to play around and let me know in the comment section as well i might do another video of this because this is so interesting and then this thing all right let's try that one more time so like this is not just for dummies but also this works for like actual players so like maybe you can host a game that you know make this invisible and then if they accidentally step on this thing you know like they die 
See that? Oh my god, with the, the freaking music. They're all gonna die. There you go. So that's how it works, guys. So yeah, this is very interesting. Like I said, a very small update, but it's a very good quality update. So yeah, I hope this video helps. Let me know in the comment section what else you know about this and get this video to at least 200 likes and I'll do a giveaway, a game pass of your choice in this game. So go ahead, like and subscribe. And that's pretty much it. See you guys in my next video. Peace.